Are you ready to do some work? Huh? You ready to do some work? Yeah? Yeah, showing off for the camera, aren't you? All right. Say hi to all your fans out there. Huh? No? You don't want to say hi? What is up, y'all? And welcome back to Off Duty Adventures. I'm Justin, and I'm glad you're here today. So, uh, if you guys have been following along, we've been trying to get this house back together. So, my videos have kind of been on a, a short decline. Uh, it's been almost a year since uh, Hurricane Ian hit, and uh, we're still trying to get this roof back together. We finally got our insulation, drywall, getting ready to do some ceiling, painting, trying to finish up some floor repairs. Got a kitchen update coming. Uh, we just got a whole lot of stuff coming, and it's coming all at once. So between working at the fire department and uh, and trying to do uh, the YouTube thing, you know, it doesn't leave for a lot of time. So we're just taking a short break. But all right, also with that said. Um, <laughs> Unfortunately, we couldn't hunt last year uh, because the hurricane. We actually did get one hunt. That's the uh, the hunt where I, I lost a deer and uh, kind of set me on this track of getting this dog. Uh, but my whole thing was was I was hoping to to get some deers last year where we could uh, get the hind legs off the deer and use those scent glands to be able to drag those across the ground to be able to teach our new pup pup how to uh, track deer unfortunately because we didn't get any deer we weren't able to do that so i've done some research and i don't, I don't know how well this is going to work so this is kind of a review and we'll kind of see uh what happens here but i went to amazon and i found this company is called a uh, dog bone and they offer a bunch of different products i don't know if you can see here light's kind of a bummer uh, but this product right here is real deer hide it's uh, been dehydrated and it comes with um it says it uses real blood uh, with a bunch of different scents in it, you know, whatever their methodology is. And the idea is, is that you put some of the scent on this uh, deer hide after you rehydrate it, and you can use that to drag. It also has a clip uh, right here that you can use to do uh, liver drags, and uh, we plan on doing that here in the future. But I've only done a couple of uh, short little straight lines with Loretta uh, using uh, calf liver. She did okay. But uh, now it's time to get serious and really see what her capabilities are. Whatever is in this, if you guys can hear her, she is going crazy. So uh, I'm pretty hopeful this is going to work good. So let me go hydrate this up and uh, we'll be back shortly. And let's see how it works. Bye, right, y'all. And just like that, we're back. Now, I look through the directions and uh, typical man, I only read what I have to read. But uh, they were a little fuzzy on exactly how to rehydrate. So I uh, soaked it in water for a few minutes. It's probably got to go a little bit longer. Uh, but we're going to give it a shot and see. And I guess when you're done, you're supposed to uh, roll it up, bag it up. You put it in the freezer to keep it from uh, deteriorating. And then next time that you want to use it, you sit it out, thaw it out, try it again. So I don't know. We'll give it a shot. All right. So I got the deer hide here. And if you see, it comes with this clip. And that's the uh, liver clip or the drag clip. And it comes with your uh, drag cord, all right? And so it's got this uh, dog bone scent solution they came up with. So you're supposed to take some of that and just uh, soak it into the hide like that. All right. And then we're going to give it a, a drag. Now, because Loretta hasn't really done this too much, um, we're going to start with just a straight drag. We're just here in, in the front yard. And uh, I'm going to drag it out probably, I don't know, like 100 feet or so and uh then we'll bring her out here shortly and and see what's up all right y'all here's loretta and her filthy under construction house come here she knows something's up so let's uh take her out front here hold on baby girl trying to do everything one-handed here one day i'll learn how to better use this camera All right, like I said, we're gonna go out to the mailbox here and uh, probably won't do much talking. We're just gonna kind of see what happens here and see if I've done anything right or not. So here goes, y'all. Ready. What you got? Find it. What you got? You got some? Find it. Where is it?
Brother. All right, maybe doing it in the street wasn't such a good idea. I had to shut the camera off for a second, grab her, and uh, get out of the road. So, hey, can you smell? Come on. Bro. Come here. Come here. No? All right, y'all, first attempt did not go well. I told you before, I didn't know what I was doing. This is all one big uh, adventure, and uh, that's what this channel is all about. Just getting out there and trying different stuff. So uh, at the risk of not knowing what I was doing, I went ahead and I uh, got it soaking. And we're gonna go like a half hour soaking in water, see what that does. But in the meantime, I wanna give you a quick update. You guys been paying attention. You know that our, our ceilings and stuff were all jacked up, but you can see they're all textured. They're hanging, they're beautiful. Right, and uh, I'm not gonna go all the way around the house because it all just kind of looks the same, but there you go. Hopefully uh, you can kind of see, as you see, we don't have our lights and stuff set up, so uh, the lighting for the GoPro is not that great. But anyways, we're getting ready to prime it, seal it, and uh, begin that whole process of uh, repainting. So hopefully we'll be starting to work on getting our stuff out of storage here soon. Oh, and uh, oh yeah, so we, uh, we got our cabinets all hung back up. I did that the other day. As you can see, we got no countertops. Uh, we're going with a uh, granite countertop. My wife has uh, been talking for years about, sorry about the light y'all. <laughs> She's been talking about years about wanting to upgrade to granite. I've been kind of against it just because, uh, you know, I'm a kind of a tight wad when it comes to money. But what mama wants, mama gets. And like I said before, uh, the hurricane kind of tore apart our kitchen, so we might as well go ahead and do that upgrade. And uh, I just know that she's gonna love them. So we're keeping the cabinets, but we're getting new countertops, so that's cool. Uh, anyways, uh, we'll be right back. And hopefully round two of the whole uh, new tracking system will go a lot better. See you in a minute. <clears throat> All right, y'all, round two. That didn't go so well the first time. Like I said before, don't really know what I'm doing. So at the risk of me not having a clue how to do this, I went ahead and I took this deer hide and I soaked it for a half hour. You can see it's much more pliable now. And uh, so I put it in a pan of water, soaked it for a half hour. I put more of the scent on it and we're gonna give it a shot. So um, I'm gonna go down the other side of the house because I don't want to repeat where our first attempt was. And uh, we're gonna go in a straight line and do it all over again. And if you've ever done this before, let me know. Is it too fast, too slow? What the heck are you supposed to do, man? Those directions are not that good. I think it's because I need pictures. If it came with pictures, probably would have done a lot better. What y'all think? All right. So that's probably about 100 feet or so. No, that's not really 100 feet. The property is 110. Uh, but that's good enough. Let's just uh, stop right there. And uh, I'm going to go get the doggy. And uh, let's try again. Hey, Loretta, where's that deer at, huh? Let's go see if we can find the deer. Find it. Find it. Find it. Where is it? Where is it? Find it. Good girl. Find it. Go find it. Loretta, find the deer. Come on. Where is it? Come on, baby girl. Where's it at? Good girl. Find it. Good girl. There she goes. I wonder if we're getting it now. What's y'all think? Good girl, Loretta. Where's the deer? Where's the deer at, Loretta? Where's that? Where's it at, baby girl? Where's that? What did you find? I said, good girl. You found a deer. Good girl. Come here. That's a good girl, you found it. You found it. That's a good girl. Oh, that's a good girl, huh? Yes, good girl. Yeah. Hey, y'all. I think it worked. She went right to it. So that's a lot better than the first attempt. So, uh, again, 
if you guys got better solutions let me know but uh that's my uh first attempt at using this new system i'm gonna try a bunch of different methods uh, i do want to get a hold of some deer legs hopefully and uh, but we're gonna just start working her through this consistently and uh, hopefully improving each time and uh, i'll make sure that uh, i'll take some videos and and i'll update you all along the way so uh hopefully you liked if you did give us a thumbs up sorry y'all uh, this neighborhood is changing day by day there's all these different noises construction new neighbors all that stuff but if you liked it give us a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed check us out man go look at our playlist check out our different videos if you like anything in there subscribe follow let's see where this adventure goes but hey y'all until next time take care god bless and we gone